Are you looking for peace of mind at your doorstep? Look no further. With the Blink Video Doorbell, your home's entrance is always within your control. Check out the link in the video description to learn more and get your Blink Video Doorbell on Amazon. Your home is in your hands. The Chase star Jenny Ryan revealed her future as the vixen on the ITV game show during an appearance on Good Morning Britain on Wednesday, as well as announcing an exciting career shift. Combining singing, comedy, and storytelling, the multi-talented star, 42, is set to embark on her out-of-the-box tour from September to November 2024, which will begin in Litchfield and end in Stafford. Despite stepping away from her fiery persona on the quiz show and launching her own tour, Jenny has delighted the Chase fans by confirming she will definitely be returning to the show. But, the TV personality also admitted that it's scary to be sharing her softer side in comparison to the stern chaser that she is known as. Opening up to hosts Ed Balls, Ranveer Singh, and entertainment correspondent Scarlett Douglas, Jenny revealed, We took the show to Edinburgh Fringe last year really on sort of a whim. It's a big risk to take something like this, as presenters know, after a stern role and you try something new. It's a bit of a challenge for people to change their expectations and perceptions of you. Putting myself out there to show a softer side of me, putting everything out there, my background, everything, was a bit of a risk. We sold out, at the fringe, and we got such excellent feedback. Runveer jumped in to ask, Jenny, can I ask, are you worried? Because presumably you're going to go back onto the chase? Are you worried that people won't be as scared of you because they'll have seen a softer side? The star laughed as she enthusiastically revealed she will be returning, following her performing stint. Jenny's out-of-the-box tour description reads, Jenny Ryan, better known as the dream-crushing brain box the vixen on the hit ITV quiz The Chase, breaks away from tea-time telly and invites you to an evening of song, storytelling, and even some showbiz secrets. Join Jenny on a journey through her life and times via some of her favorite tunes, sung live with the powerful voice which blew the judges away on X Factor Celebrity. Her decision to embrace this new career adventure follows her appearance on X Factor, Celebrity back in 2019. She wowed the judges and the audience with her amazing vocals, with Jenny bringing the house down when she performed a spine-tingling version of Adele Skyfall on the show. Despite her efforts, she was defeated in the live finals, with former Toei star Megan McKenna going on to win the show. Jenny initially failed to make it through to the live shows, however, in a shock U-turn, the judges overturned their decision and allowed the quiz queen to return to the ITV competition and battle it out against the other acts. After the initial choice had been made, the judges sat down to once again consider the celebrity's performance. Speaking of the change, Nicole said, Jenny was just brilliant at her audition in LA. That voice of hers is one of a kind, and she's an amazing person to get to know. So it was such a tough decision to make. After a lot of discussion we all agreed we had to put her through. The Overs are gonna smash it this year. Jenny's career move sees her follow in the footsteps of fellow Chaser and Hegarty, who announced in April she's been cast in a short film and will swap the ITV quiz for the big screen. The TV personality, 65, said that filming would begin later this year and she'd be using her pantomime experience to help while making her debut in front of the camera. She told Daily Star, I've been asked to be in the film and I've decided to go for it. We're going to be making that in the next few months. I don't think I'll be nervous. It's not in front of an audience. If it was, I'd be thinking, oh my god am I going to forget my lines? But because there won't be an audience watching, I'm not worried. Anne, who has appeared as the governess on the ITV show since 2010, also revealed whether her new role would mean she was leaving the series. She told publication, I don't have any plans to retire. The chase is, the little workhorse that makes everything else possible and I love doing it. It's the best job I've ever had, so I'm happy to keep going as long as they want me for.